What up, Facebook, YouTube, Twitter, Fancy Princess, SoundCloud, SoundQuick, your boy Tone202. What's happening, Donald Gilbert? You seem to have a problem with me using uh, announcers or other people saying the same thing that I'm saying. Donald, I really don't know what to tell you, uh, but uh, I'm glad you're a subscriber. So there's that. Uh, I pretty much use information that is pretty blatant showing that the NBA, the NFL, and other sports are fixed. Now, in this case, I'm talking about the contracts. Now, we've, been, uh, we've had this conversation before, not particularly me and you, Donald, but people on my channel uh, who are skeptical about sports, uh, just like myself. This channel is an open channel. I talk about anything from God to sports to a cavity, okay? Now, in this particular case, we're talking about the money that these people make. Now, they're throwing around these huge, huge numbers and talking about what James Harden is going to make 20, uh, let's see, uh, 228 million in four years. Let's see, uh, Steph Curry just got, uh, he's under contract for the next four years, either four or five years for uh, $201 million. Uh, people like, you know, Kawhi Leonard, you know, LeBron, uh, Nowinski, you know, a lot of, you know, even Kyrie Irving, you know, he was at $29 million. Uh, I forgot how long that was, though. I know that wasn't for one year. But nonetheless, so when we talk about salary cap, when we talk about luxury tax and so on and so forth, this, this right here is a breakdown of some of the reasons why these players uh, cause a team to go in the luxury tax, why Kyrie Irving can be traded and Cleveland is relieved of $29 million and then get three players plus a first round pick, and why a lot of these players go broke. That's a key thing there, because a lot of these players go broke once they leave the NBA, the NFL, uh, and every other sports when they're not getting that money anymore because these large contracts are spit at them. And then, you know, once you take away your tax, your agent fees, so on and so forth, the next thing you know, you know you're know, you broke. You didn't really have $33 million coming in. You had half of that. Now, let's listen to some of this. Difference there. He's a resident of the state of Ohio. Uh, agent fees. Let's which, go back. He's a resident of, so he loses that ten. Let's go back. About thirty-three million dollars, just over that. How much of that will he actually? Okay, so let's just take you through it. So he loses that ten percent because of that escrow. He's got the federal taxes. Obviously, there's no difference there. He's a resident of the state of Ohio. Uh, agent fees. We assumed about three percent. 401k. You could only take eighteen thousand dollars out. Then he gets the escrow back. That's that $1.6 million from last year. That's tax. And then there's something, a shortfall this year, which is interesting. Each player got about $350,000 back uh, because there was a... And there you have it. So there is a rundown of the contracts. Now, we don't know what else is coming out of this. Because, you know, you have your other lawyer fees. You know, your agent and your lawyer is not always the same person. Okay. So we don't know how else how else the NBA, NFL, MLB, uh, soccer league, and so on. We don't know what else that they're paying into. But I told you guys that they were paying into the NBA. You know what I'm saying? So this whole shortfall is basically the reason why they got that back is something that has to do with um, 51 percent, yada yada yada. And uh, if 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 there if it, if something is over fifty one percent, then they got to pay uh, a certain amount into which is this one hundred and eighty eight thousand dollars and three hundred and eighty eight you know whatever. So being that I think it was something happened where it was less than fifty one percent, they get this money back so on and so forth. But nonetheless, I'm not a lawyer or a contract writer or anything of that circumstance. But I wanted to, to just show you guys. Uh, some of the reasons why why some of these players go broke, some of the reasons why uh, uh, these players are actually they're not they're not struggling until they go out and buy these you know cars and yachts and all this stuff and they're really not making that money. And a, and, and one of the biggest reasons why this is so important. Now this is LeBron James. This is probably the highest player in the NBA right now. Uh, until those other two get those large contracts. So, 
Boom. This is, or he's one of the highest players right now, but he's the most important. Okay. He's the most important person in the NBA right now. And this is $16 million, but this is, this is so important. This is another reason why there are contracts outside of the NBA that these players go after. This is another reason why the shoe contract, the Nike contract that LeVar Ball, uh, Ball turned down for his son, the Armor Ar the Armor All uh, contract, the Gatorade, the cars, the, the, the watches, the whatever that they sell, peanut butter, uh, socks, underwear, uh, Michael Jordan, hot dogs. This is why these players have gone after that other revenue. Because of this, they know they're going to lose half their money. Now, just imagine if you're a bench warmer, which I think the league minimum is somewhere like 1.5 or whatever. You're only getting 500000 of that. Listen, you are balling on a budget. I know that's a lot of money to us regular people, but still, for somebody in the NBA, you're not keeping up with the big house. You're not. Listen, <laughs> Daron Williams. <laughs> okay, here's a better case. Derrick Rose. Derrick Rose just got what? Two million? He got league minimum. He got contract league minimum. So he might make a million dollars after tax contracts and everything. MVP status from the Bulls, now league minimum. You guys, this is this is all the NBA is fixed. Okay, you guys. And it's it's a I mean, it's blatant right here how much money is taken away from these guys. And this is what causes them to do half of the stuff that they do. Now, you can keep watching the trash if you want to, but I no longer watch it. So it's your boy, Tone202. I just want to enlighten well, because some Because they people. did not get the 51%. Yeah, the 51%. I'll let somebody else explain it. I'm out. Peace.